Welcome back everybody to Cooking with a Kid. Thank you for coming back and joining us. Tonight I'm going to share more of a story because of all the recipes I've done this is probably one of the simplest because there's only two ingredients depending on what you want to put in it. So right now we're going to do right here on Cooking with a Kid boiled peanuts. I'm going to put some pictures in right here to show you how peanuts are grown. Peanuts are actually grown under the ground, like a bush. And so I know many of you may not know that, but that's okay, that's how we learn. Growing up, my family always had peanuts. My grandfather, my uncle, my dad, always growing peanuts in the field. And so we would have peanut boilings. What they do is take a big black cast iron pot, they would pull the peanuts, they would wash them off, put them in the pot, and then invite people from all around to come and enjoy boiled peanuts. Some of you don't like boiled peanuts, and that's okay. You may like them fried or buttered, parched, ever how you like peanuts. But this is a different way. It's called boiled. It's a southern thing. And so I'm going to show you very simple just with salt, regular standard ones, but you can kick it up with cayenne pepper. You can cook it up, kick it up with some uh, chili pepper, whatever you want to do. Uh, change the flavor, but we're just going to show you basic boiled peanuts right here on Cooking with the Kids. Stick with us, you might enjoy it and you might learn something. Also, what we're going to do, these are actually green peanuts. You can get peanuts that are dried, you can get them that have been uh, parched, but these have actually come right out of the field. And when I say they're green, that doesn't mean that they're actually green on the inside. What it means is that they are fresh right out of the field there they are that's what they look like hopefully you can see that so that's what they are uh, when they deep fry peanuts you can actually eat the shell and all when you boil peanuts you need to shell them to eat them you don't want to eat the shell so what I've done is I've taken them my dad has picked them off the bushes he's kind of washed them off I've washed them off again run them under the water in this strainer. So I'm going to use some kosher, coarse kosher salt, some water, and the peanuts, and we're going to put them in there. We're going to let them boil. So we usually turn them up on high, let them start boiling, then we turn them down, and then uh, we let them go. You say, well, how long? It will depend on how big the pot is, you know, how big the peanuts are, because peanuts come in different sizes. These are kind of like a Valencia peanut. Uh, and so they come in different sizes, but you'll know when they're ready. Uh, I'll show you what the, the holes on the peanut, the outside, will start to look like as they boil. And we'll look at that right now. Okay, we, we've kind of skipped ahead a little bit. They've been in the water now boiling for a little while. Here's a little bit, it says Paula Dean on it. Hey, y'all. Um, here's, here's a little hint. If you're cooking some peas or beans or even peanuts, they'll foam up when you're boiling them and they'll they'll run over but if you take a wooden spoon and place across the top of it it will stop the foam from flowing over boiling over in the pot so as you see they're boiling away uh, another thing is when you're tasting them for saltiness if you like you adjust the saltiness to your flavor but as they sit in the water after you turn them off they will absorb more salt flavor so you don't want to over salt them and uh, and it'd be too salty you can't eat them so we're gonna let those go for a while they've been going now for about 30 45 minutes probably and you can see they've started to change color I've got one that hasn't been in the water you can see what it looks like see how bright the shell is and you can see how they've started to turn they'll get darker as you boil them and uh, they'll be ready all right, everybody, we've let them boil for about two and a half, three hours. And you can tell they've already softened up. So I'm going to get some. I've already been eating some of them. I'll get some of them out and put on a plate and show you what they look like. Like I said, if you want something different, like I say, some people put a little onion powder, a little garlic powder, some Cajun spices in it, just to kick them up a different notch. These are southern boiled peanuts with just salt. So that's the way we've always had them. That's the way we enjoy them. You make them any way you want to. If you don't like boiled peanuts, that's okay. 
There are plenty of other ways to have them besides boiled. I'll put some on a plate right now. Here they are, everybody, still steaming hot. These things were in the field day before yesterday. You don't get any fresher than that. All right, everybody, thank you for watching Cooking with a Kid. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. Please give us a thumbs up, like the video. Um, let us know what you think about boiled peanuts. They are very hot. But they are very good. It's an acquired taste, but I've had it since I was a kid. So I love them. All right, everybody, thanks again for watching. We will see you all next time. Please continue to support the channel, and uh, we appreciate you. Until next time, goodbye.